As the saying goes, all good things must come to an end. But that doesn't mean there can't be a fresh start. At Honda Financial Services, we are constantly looking for ways to make our lease maturity process as convenient and smooth as possible. We value your business and would like you to purchase another Honda. With this in mind, we created this video which outlines what to expect when your lease comes to an end. To begin the process, Honda Financial Services will contact you by mail and one of our representatives by phone several months prior to your lease maturity date to review the process and make you aware of our loyalty offers and sales incentives available on your next Honda vehicle. The next contact occurs 30 to 45 days before your contract maturity date. A representative from our business partner, Datascan, will contact you to schedule an appointment to inspect your vehicle. We contact customers with a reminder the day before the appointment, and we perform an NLE's vehicle inspection ahead of time so customers have time to make repairs if needed. Datascan has been working with Honda since 1999. They have been engaged to capture the condition of the vehicle. We understand that a certain amount of vehicle wear and tear is normal, and we certainly take this into account. To that end, we encourage you to review the lease care guide you received. In particular, please familiarize yourself with the wear and tear section of the guide prior to the inspection. The end of lease vehicle inspection takes place at a location and time that's convenient for you between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. on weekdays. Although it's your choice, we do encourage you to stay during the inspection. Bring two sets of keys and the valet key, if applicable. Also bring the owner's manual to the vehicle inspection. The car should be clean and the trunk empty. First, the inspection establishes that the car is in good working order. It continues to cover four areas of the vehicle exterior panels and bumpers, the windshield and glass, the interior, and wheels and tires. During the inspection, Datascan will take 20 to 25 photos of the vehicle. Most of these photos will be used to help resell the vehicle. We want to ensure that the new buyer gets a full account of the condition of your vehicle. The inspection process will take approximately 45 minutes. The Datascan representative may point out any issues. Non-chargeable wear and tear includes things like small stone chips on the hood or front bumper, interior scuffs, cracks or tears of 1.5 centimeters or less, three or fewer small chips in the windshield without cracks that are less than 3.2 millimeters, or replacement tires that meet or exceed the manufacturer's specifications recommended for this vehicle. Chargeable wear and tear might include more than 15 stone chips on the hood or front bumper, or interior cracks, tears, singes, or stains greater than 1.5 centimeters. You'll find more details in the Lease Care Guide. At the end of the inspection, you'll receive a preliminary inspection report and an inspection information card. The card tells you where to access the final vehicle inspection report online in about two days after the inspection. If you have any questions regarding the report, please contact the Customer Retention Center and one of our representatives will be happy to assist you. Once the inspection report is finalized, your Honda dealer will call you to review the report and discuss your options. Of course, we'd like to help get you into a new Honda. We have special loyalty offers if you stick with the Honda brand. Your dealer will discuss this with you, or feel free to contact Honda Financial Services at any time to learn more. On the final day of the lease, return the car to your Honda dealership. The dealer briefly inspects the vehicle and gives you the final summary. You'll also receive a vehicle return receipt for your records and the keys to your new Honda.